Hello, my dearlings. Today I'm feeling a little bit philosophical. Maybe it's because of, you know, chill. Mm -hmm. Or maybe it's because of the weather changing. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I'm always different. One day I'm one way and the next day I'm just a little bit different. I change like the weather. I didn't know that I could change all sorts of things. And long, long time ago, I read this quote by Margaret Mead, a fantastic teacher. And uh, what was she? A person who digs up bones and, oh, the words on the tip of my tongue. Never mind. It'll come to me. Archaeologist. See? Just like that. As soon as I stopped worrying, she said, never doubt that a small group of thoughtful, committed citizens can change the world. Indeed, she says, it's the only thing that ever has. A small, thoughtful group of citizens. That could be us. I know it can start with me. Because through this 40 day process, I've learned that I can change myself a little bit at a time. Now change takes time and time takes time. And so my question always was, well, how much time does change take and how much change do I get to put into the time? And I would get very sort of concerned with that part. And then I realized, hold on, it's a little bit like coins in my change box or my change drawer. When I just look at it scattered in there, it doesn't look like a lot of money. But as I keep tipping more change into that pot of coins, it can suddenly add up to a sum of money, a useful sum of money. And the same thing with time. Hello, a few minutes today, a few minutes tomorrow, a few minutes the next day, and then the next day, kaboom, I've made some changes. But if I don't make the change in this moment now, I can promise myself to make a change tomorrow, but the only time I can make the changes is now, in this very moment. Eckhart Tolle says it's called The Power of Now. That's one of his books, The Power of Now. So. Why don't you give yourself some now and make a little change? All right, my lovelies. I will see you tomorrow. Love you. Bye.